In the Mix, presented by California Pizza Kitchen, now located in the second floor of the Plaza Shopping Center across from DFS Galleria. Welcome back to In the Mix. I'm so excited about this brand new segment with Cammy. Hey guys. Hey, hey, so what do you got? Well, it's the Pepsi Pulse and we're gonna be taking a look about what's good in the entertainment business. Pepsi Pulse is brought to you by Pepsi Guam Bottling. First up, the place to be this weekend is the Plaza in Tumon for the grand opening of the Guam Art Exhibit. GAX is celebrating its 11th season featuring the launch of 2019 Powwow Guam. Along with the visiting artists, GAX will feature the talent of more than 30 local artists. You can also pick up GAX merch right now at the pop-up shop at the Plaza, Wednesdays through Sundays from 6 to 10 p.m. They've been rehearsing over the last several months and Mamma Mia is hitting the stage this month. Directed by Ernest Ochoco, opening night is set for April 25th at the FD Phoenix Center. The Broadway musical turned movie hit in 2008 is based on the story of a young bride who was raised by her single mother. In the search for her father on the eve of her wedding, she invites three men who she thinks one could be her dad. The drama ensues, but you can purchase tickets at Circle K76, Tango Theaters, and at FD. Follow Guam Gate Theater on social media for more information. The music world and his fans all across the globe were rocked with the tragic news that Grammy-nominated rapper Nipsey Hussle was shot dead outside his clothing store in Los Angeles earlier this week. Hussle was nominated for Best Rap Album at this year's Grammy Awards for his debut studio album, Victory Lap. He is also described as a philanthropist and advocate for his hometown of South Los Angeles. In recent years, he was noted for his involvement in the development of Destination Crenshaw, which is described as an open-air museum dedicated to honoring African-American artistic achievement. Athletes and music artists, including Drake, Rihanna, and J. Cole, as well as LA-based DJ Big Boy, have been paying tribute to Nipsey and his impact on the hip-hop community. You know when people are special, and Nipsey was and is very special, not just to hip hop, but just to to earth. I mean, he's, you know, outside the box, cared about his community, hard worker, you know, just a good soul, you know, and character is what's being spoke about you when you're not in the room. And these are the things that we said about Nipsey while he was here. And the winner of the NAACP Entertainer of the Year, sponsored by Ford, is... Beyonce! And while the world is mourning the death of Nipsey Hussle, her fans are celebrating her victory as Beyonce was named the NAACP's Entertainer of the Year. Congratulations to Bay. This is her second time winning the NAACP Entertainment of the Year Award. The world has changed. None of us can go back. And finally, all you Marvel fans, we got the hookup for tickets to the premiere screening on Friday, April 26th at 7 p.m. at the Agania Stadium Theaters. If you recall, the universe was left in ruins from Avengers Infinity War and this sequel as the remaining superheroes allies come together once again to undo Thanos actions and restore order to the universe. If you want tickets and be one of the first to watch the movie, check us out at any of our social media platforms, the KOM News mobile app, or listen to i94FM for your chance to win. Check KOM.com or the KWAM News mobile app for complete rules and regulations. That's it for the Pepsi Pulse. I'm Cammie. Bye. Great job. Thank you. Thank you. Stay tuned. We're back with more after the break.